It is confirmed that Korea's swimming champion Park Tae-hwan will be going to Rio. The highest tribunal for sport arbitration has ruled that Park has the right to compete at this summer's Olympics after completing his doping ban and deemed that any additional suspensions by the Korean Olympic Committee would not be justified. The man who brought Korea's first ever Olympic gold in swimming gets the break he deserves. Here's Kwon Jang-ho on what could be possibly his last Olympic run. Park Tae-wan, also known as Marine Boy, will be on the plane to Rio after the Court of Arbitration for Sport, the highest quasi-judicial body in international sport, ruled Park eligible for selection to compete in next month's Olympic Games. The ruling affirms the notion that Park concluded his suspension and an additional ban would be a case of double jeopardy or being punished twice for the same offence. The Olympic gold medalist had tested positive for testosterone in 2014 and received an 18-month ban issued by the international swimming body, FINA. Although that ran out in March of this year, the Korean Olympic Committee had its own rule which bans athletes found guilty of doping for a further three years. Park appealed this ban to CAS and the international body has now ruled in its favour. Although the KOC has rejected previous appeals made by PAC, it says it will respect the tribunal's decision and has promptly added PAC's name to the Korean national team roster, which is sent to be submitted to FINA by 7 a.m. on Saturday, Korea time. The KOC is now also said to be considering changing its stance on additional bans. PAC has been preparing for this decision by taking part in the national swimming trials and winning all four of his races and within Olympic qualifying times. But now, with less than a month to go, the pressure is on to get ready and bring home another medal to write a new chapter in Korea's swimming history. Kwon Jang-ho, Arirang News.